Hello again to your weekly lick. Uh, today, the third lesson. Um, hope you enjoyed the first two. And uh, as I told you last week, uh, this time we will uh, get a note for note breakdown on this uh, B minor pentatonic run, ascending and descending. Um, I showed you the patterns last week, so I think now it will be much easier to get through this lick. First of all, I show you this uh, run slowly. <laughs> Okay, so um, this time we start not in the first uh, box position of the B minor pentatonic, but we start in the fifth box position, uh, starting on the fifth fret on the low E string. And now basically do uh, the basic uh, pattern I showed you last week, you know, uh, with a down stroke on the fifth fret, hammer on to the seventh fret going to the 5th fret on the A string with a down stroke again 7th uh, fret on the A string we do an up stroke a pull off and then this left hand hammer on you know by now I think um, so okay group of 6 notes uh, 16th triplet so we start again with the same pattern this time starting on the A string on the 7th fret on the E here uh, first finger here then hammer on to the 9th fret, go to the 7th fret on the D string again with the 1st finger, go to the 9th fret on the D string with an up stroke, do the pull off again, and the left hand hammer on. You know, same pattern, just in a different position. Okay. Then uh, there's a variation on this pattern. I also showed you this uh, last lesson. Uh, this time we just play the um, remaining four notes of the first pattern. So this means we are on the seventh fret on the D string with a down stroke, do the up stroke on the ninth fret, the pull off, and the left hand hammer on. Okay. Then I go back to the seventh fret on the D string with an up stroke again, a down stroke on the ninth fret on the A string. Then I slide back into the fifth box position. Um, being the seventh fret with the third finger, a pull off to the fifth fret, and I play the seventh fret on the low E string. So we got this. Okay, do it again. Okay. Then we start over with the uh, with the same pattern. But actually, um, again, repeat this thing on the A string, same position. Okay, and then skip the D string, go straight to the G string, and uh, play the first with the first thing on the seventh fret, with a down stroke, an up stroke on the tenth fret, being the blue note of the B minor uh, scale, and. Uh, pull off again to the 7th fret, hammer on to the 9th fret, pull off to the 7th fret and you know by now the uh, left hand hammer on this time to the D string with the 3rd finger, 9th fret okay so okay then we repeat our pattern again this time on the uh, G string uh, and instead of the 9th fret I use again the blue note just you know makes it I think sound more more interesting and um, a little more bluesy this way so 7th uh, fret G string down stroke hammer onto the 10th fret go to the B string 7th fret then go to the 10th fret with the little finger here do the up stroke do the pull off and again to the uh, left hand hammer, this time with the little finger, which is maybe a little bit more difficult than to do it with the third finger because, of course, the little finger is the weakest, so um, um, it needs more practice, actually. So this alone would actually make a good uh, exercise for your little finger. Okay, so this is what we got so far.
Okay, so now we do a position shift and we go from the uh, first box position of the B minor pentatonic scale into the second box position of the B minor pentatonic scale. Um, this would be the tenth fret on the B string with the first finger. Then this is downstroke oh, again, and I think you know the pattern by now. It's like down, down, up, down, down, up, down, down, up. You know, always the same. Um, then uh, do the uh, hammer on with the third finger to the twelfth fret on the B string. Then go to the E string, tenth fret again, downstroke, and now. Another variation of this pattern uh, was the second variation I showed you last week. Um, I add the third box position by using my little finger here on the uh, 14th thread. Put an upstroke, do the pull off to the 10th thread, do the hammer on to the 12th thread, and the pull off again. And the left hand hammer on. So we got eight notes here. Okay, so this would be the, the ascending part of this uh, B minor pentatonic one. Okay, so now the uh, descending part begins, and um, now we go in the, into the pattern of the uh, first lesson actually. Um, if you remember, it's this uh, five note pattern. Um, I'm still in the second box position of the B minor pentatonic scale and I play the 10th uh, fret on the high E string with my first finger with an upstroke, then a downstroke on the 10th fret on the B string and then do a hammer on pull off thing with the 12th fret on the same. And uh, you know the left hand hammer on this time on the 11th fret on the G string. So five notes. One, two, three, four, five. So then, to change the position again, do this little slide lick here. 10th uh, fret on the B string with the first finger, with the second finger on the 11th fret on the G string, slide down to the 9th fret and pull off to the 7th uh, fret, all on the G string. Okay. Could actually also use your third finger. Actually, I think I used the third finger, but you could use second also. Okay, then uh, we repeat this five note pattern, this time starting on the B string with an upstroke on the seventh fret, downstroke on the seventh fret on the G string, hammer on pull off, ninth fret back to the seventh, and the left hand hammer on, on the ninth fret on the D string. So we got five, four, Okay, uh, then to finish off this lick, uh, a bending on the 7th fret on the G string. And I also do here a um, um, pinch harmonic. You know, and bend the note up a whole step to the 9th fret. Okay, after this, um, downstroke on the 9th fret on the D string, pull off to the 7th fret. And left hand hammer on to the seventh fret on the uh, A string. Okay, would be this. Then a string skip back to the seventh fret on the G string with the first finger, third finger on the ninth fret on the A string. Slide down to the seventh fret now again in the fifth uh, box position. Pull off to the uh, seventh fret. Uh, sorry, to the fifth fret and um, go back to the 7th fret on the A string. And in the end I add a bending again. Again you could do a pinch harmonic, but you don't have to actually. It's you know, your taste what you do. Okay, so this is the descending part. Okay, so this is the complete, complete lick altogether.
I played once more for you. Okay. Have fun practicing this and um, have a good week. Take care.